2023 will be a sensational year for astronomy. Expect radiant meteor showers, breathtaking eclipses, and close encounters with other planets. Prepare your telescopes and be ready to mark your calendar as we unveil the much-awaited astronomical events of 2023. January 3rd to 4th, Quadrantids Meteor Shower. We kick off 2023 with the magnificent Quadrantids Meteor Shower. Be sure that you are in a dark location after midnight and point those telescopes at the constellation Boötes. March 20th, March Equinox. On this day, the sun will shine directly on the equator as we welcome the March equinox. There will be nearly equal amounts of day and night throughout the world. This is also the first day of spring in the Northern Hemisphere and the first day of fall in the Southern Hemisphere. April 20th, Hybrid Solar Eclipse. For the first time in almost 10 years, we will experience a rare hybrid solar eclipse. A hybrid solar eclipse occurs when the moon is so close that the shadow moves across the Earth's surface. This type of eclipse will appear as a total eclipse in some parts of the world and will appear as an annular eclipse in others. It will only be visible throughout most of Indonesia and Australia. April 22nd to 23rd, Linnids Meteor Shower. Astronomy fans will be in for another treat as the Linnids Meteor Shower will be putting on a show. It will produce about 20 meteors per hour at its peak. Bring your friends and family as the best viewing will be from a dark location after midnight. Gaze at the constellation Lyra and expect numerous jaw-dropping meteors. May 5th, Penumbral Luna Eclipse. Another eclipse is coming our way, but this time it is a penumbral lunar eclipse. It occurs when Earth's outer shadow falls on the moon's face, causing it to appear darker. This intriguing phenomenon will be available throughout all of Asia, Australia, parts of Eastern Europe, and Eastern Africa. May 6th to 7th, Eta Aquarids Meteor Shower two meteor showers in less than a month. Now, it is Eta Aquarid's meteor shower's turn to put on a breathtaking experience. There is a high chance of catching one because it will be producing up to 60 meteors per hour at its peak. It is produced by dust particles left behind by the famous Halley's Comet. June 4th, Venus Close Approach. Venus lovers will be in for a delight as the planet will reach its greatest eastern elongation of 45.4 degrees from the sun. This will be the best time to view the planet as it will be at its highest point above the horizon. June 21st, June Solstice. On this day, we will welcome the start of the June Solstice, wherein the North Pole of the Earth will be tilted towards the Sun. This is the first day of the much-awaited Summer Solstice in the Northern Hemisphere and the first day of the Winter Solstice in the Southern Hemisphere. July 3rd, the first supermoon. The moon will be near its closest approach to the Earth as we experience the first supermoon in the year. The moon will be located on the opposite side of the Earth from the sun, and its face will be fully illuminated. This is the first of four supermoons in 2023. Keep watching. July 28th to 29th, Delta Aquarids. The Delta Aquarids meteor shower will bring out up to 20 meteors per hour as it peaks on the night of July 28th through the morning of July 29th. Meteors will be clearly visible after midnight in the constellation of Aquarids. Conditions may not be ideal as the nearly full moon may block fainter meteors. August 1st, Sturgeon Moon. The second of the four supermoons of 2023. Early American tribes called this full moon the Sturgeon Moon because large sturgeon fish of the Great Lakes were more easily caught at this time of the year. The moon will be near to its closest approach to Earth and may look slightly larger and brighter than your usual full moon. August 12th to 13th, Perseid Meteor Shower. The Perseid Meteor Shower is one of the most highly anticipated meteor showers every year. It is famous for producing a large number of marvelous bright meteors, and you have the chance to see 60 of them per hour. Meteors will mostly come from the constellation Perseus after midnight. August 27th, Saturn Close Approach. The long wait for Saturn fans will be over, as the ringed planet will be at its closest approach to Earth. This will be Saturn's brightest approach all throughout the year, and will be visible all night long. Prepare those telescopes, as this will be the best time to view and photograph Saturn, along with its phenomenal rings and moons. August 31st, Blue Supermoon. August is the month for all the moon enthusiasts out there, as this will be the second supermoon of this month. Since this is the second full moon in August, it is referred to as the Blue Moon. 
This only happens every two and a half years. It will not literally be seen as blue, though it will sure be brighter as it illuminates the dark evening sky. September 19th, Neptune Close Approach. Get ready as the farthest planet in the solar system will be at its closest approach to Earth. Neptune will be fully illuminated by the sun and will be at its brightest all year. Due to its extreme distance, it may appear to be just a blue dot in the sky. But if you have a powerful telescope, you may be able to capture the planet clearly. September 23rd, September Equinox. The sun will once again shine directly on the equator as there will be almost equal amounts of day and night throughout the world. It'll be the start of fall and spring in some parts of the world. September 29th, Final Supermoon. The fourth and final supermoon will occur on this day. If you miss the other ones, this is your last chance this year to capture the magnificent moon. October 7th, Draconids Meteor Shower. The Draconids are a small meteor shower that produce 10 meteors per hour. Meteors will be visible in the constellation Draco and will be prominent just after the sun sets. October 14th, Annular Solar Eclipse. Arguably the most exciting eclipse of all. The annular solar eclipse, or the Ring of Fire, happens when the moon passes between the Earth and the Sun, but while the moon is at its farthest point from Earth. The eclipse path will begin in the Pacific Ocean while it moves across the southwestern United States to Mexico and Brazil. The northern parts of America will experience a partial eclipse. October 28th, Partial Luna Eclipse. Another partial luna eclipse will occur as it will darken the moon slightly throughout all of Europe, Asia, Africa, and Western Australia. November 4th to 5th. The long-running meteor shower Taurids will be showing off 5 to 10 meteors per hour in the constellation Taurus. It will be visible throughout midnight and up until morning. November 13th, Uranus Close Approach. The second farthest planet from the Sun will be making its closest approach to Earth. Uranus will be at its brightest today. November 17th to 18th, Leonids Meteor Shower. The Leonids are a meteor shower associated with the comet Temple Tuttle, which is known for its spectacular meteor storms that occur about every 33 years. It will be producing about 15 of the fastest and most colorful fireballs per hour in the constellation Leo. December 13th to 14th, Geminids Meteor Shower. Behold, the king of meteor showers. The Geminids are considered the best shower in the heavens, producing up to 120 multicolored meteors per hour at their peak. Perfect conditions to view the amazing Geminids in the constellation Gemini. Since there is a new moon, the sky is pretty dark. December 21st to 22nd, Ursids Meteor Shower. Get ready for the last meteor shower of the year, the Ursids Meteor Shower. It is a minor meteor shower, offering up to 5 to 10 meters in the constellation Ursa Minor. December 22nd, December Solstice. The last astronomical event of 2023, the December Solstice. The south pole of the Earth will be tilted towards the sun. This kicks off the first day of winter and summer in some parts of the world. December 31st, Happy New Year. Our spaceship, planet Earth, has completed another revolution around the sun. Happy New Year.